Hello, this is Joe Wiles with the Rock and Roll Conservatory, and you're watching Today in Rock History. Today is November 9th, and on this day, in 1990, the Internal Revenue Service seized all of country singer Willie Nelson's bank accounts and real estate holdings in connection with a $16 million tax debt. If that's not rock and roll, I don't know what is. But in honor of Willie Nelson's tax debt, we're going to learn On the Road Again. Let's take a look. All right, to play Willie Nelson's On the Road Again, we're going to want to know about five different chords. The first one is an E major. It's an open E string. Second fret A, second fret D, first fret G, B, and high E open. Sounds like this. The next one is a G sharp major. It's basically the same E major chord. We're going to switch it out so that our index finger is free. So ring finger on the second of the A, pinky on the second of the D, and middle on the first of the G. But we're going to slide it up the guitar neck. Four frets. One, two, three, four. Then take our index finger and bar across the entire fourth fret. So basically it goes four, six, six, five, four, four, or four, six, six, five, four, four. Sounds like this. The next one is an F sharp minor chord. Pretty darn close to this one, except we're going to slide it down two frets. One, two, and then lift off our middle finger. That's the second fret on the bar with, here, on the low E string. Fourth fret with your ring finger. Fourth fret with your pinky on the D. Third, uh, second fret G, second fret B, second fret high E. Sounds like this. Next one is a B major chord. We're going to keep the same fret bar, the second fret. We're going to make an A major chord form if you know what that looks like. I'll explain it if you don't. We're barring the second fret with our index finger. And we're going to start from the A string down. So on the A string, we have the second fret barred back here. Fourth fret on the D, fourth fret on the G, fourth fret on the B with these three fingers, and then second fret on the high E string. Sounds like this. I think that's about all the chords. Let's take a look at them in context. You're going to start with an E major chord. Give it like a nice hokey finoki country tonk type uh, strumming pattern. Slide up to the G sharp major. Slide down to the F sharp minor. A major chord. B major chord, then E major chord. And I just realized I did not teach you the A major chord. Open A, second fret D, second fret G, second fret B, open high E, sounds like this. Put that in context. The chorus starts out with that A major chord. Down to the E. Back to the A. Down to the E again, and up to the B major. And then you repeat the whole sequence over again. So now you can build a campfire, bust out your acoustic guitars, and rock some Willie Nelson. Join us tomorrow for another segment for Today in Rock History. I'll see you then.